Uh, good afternoon, we are at the Travel Distribution Summit in London and we're with Ken Froling from Viator, who if I've got it right is a, a leading force in the tours and activities market, is that? That's right, we do tours, activities and sightseeing around the globe. Yep. And it, it's been said, is tours and activities the next big battleground for online distribution? I think it's ne the next frontier for sure. Uh, you know, we've seen kind of the evolution of what people will do online from air to hotel to car to vacation rental and the next logical step is what you do when you get to the destination. Yeah. And what, what's, what's the biggest distribution channel for tools and activities? Uh, right for us at Viator, our B2C site, Viator.com, is our biggest channel. So direct? Direct business is about 80% of our, of our business. The other 20 are distribution partners, airlines, hotels, uh, and other sites. And from those different segments, which, which segments are they doing the best? Uh, actually, the two segments that do the best for us, number one would be content type sites. Uh, so if you're on a site looking at a destination like Barcelona, you're highly qualified to make a booking for a tour and activity. Uh, the second group, surprisingly, are travel agents. Travel agents are still strong supporters and bookers in tours and activities, and we can enable that. We've, had heard, we've heard some conversation here today about hoteliers using this for when people, because obviously they want to own the consumer, of course. and the big advantage for them is when the consumer's in the hotel selling these products. That's right. Do you see that? Was that the concierge doing that, or is there a move to more mobile, last-minute distribution? There's some of both. You know, there is a little bit of friction there yet, where uh, a, a good mobile app with things to do uh, and that can really help you explore the journey can actually replace the concierge. And there's a certain type of traveler that would really rather do that. They'd rather explore online and do it themselves, decide what they want to do. The the challenge is making it bookable and actionable by the yeah. customer. So there's the challenge getting the inventory, or Often the challenge is getting in the inventory. So your uh, white label product's quite good for that. It is, yeah. White label, <laughs> white label mobile product works for yeah. that. You know, we work with a number of vendors around the world, from you know a single operator with a couple of jeeps to a large, large organization. And so there's no standard technology. So we have have put that together, making all these products bookable. And when are the majority of tours and activities booked? Is it at the point of sale, or is it closer to? Is it from pre-trip emails or? Yeah, it depends on the partner or on Viator. You know, I think a lot of, the closer you get to the travel date, the more likely you are to purchase. Right. You know, today it's beautiful and sunny in London right now, so I might look at my <laughs> mobile site. We all look outside to see if it is. It was raining just now. Just I know. <laughs> uh, and, you know, so there's a lot of kind of serendipity in it as well. There's a lot of impromptu bookings of things to do that you may not book in advance because you're not sure what you want to do. Has that changed the booking models, the, the, the size of the booking cart? No. Absolutely. You know, the, the average booking on the web is, is about two times higher than what you'll see on mobile. But that's because mobile is very opportunistic. You just yeah. choose to quickly make a booking now for today. Yeah. Uh, we have 80% of our products that can be booked within 24 hours. Wow, because that has changed a lot, hasn't it's it? It's changed a lot. From a few years ago, that number was probably less than 50%. Less than 50, and that's been driven by mobile? Been driven a lot by mobile and by connecting to vendors and getting real-time inventory. Okay, all right. Ken, that's fantastic. Hope you enjoy the conference. Great, thanks, Tim. Thank you. Cheers.